If this is your expectation for a video game, you may not want to go any further. For those of you who might be interested in scaring the sheet off of people in an extremely clever way, take a look at this. Ghostmaster for the PC is a giant mixed salad of horror reference and insightful puzzle solving that might just creep between you and your trigger finger for a while. It seems like there's something going on around here. They talk like Sims. They move like Sims. They even think like Sims. But who cares? You're not a Sim. Can't find our way out. I smell dead people. You're the ghostly gas of the netherworld. Your job? To scare the crap out of every sim you see. Coupled with accessible controls and fast navigation, this game supplies the right amount of eye of newt to any action, strategy, and puzzle-solving potion. If you hate arrogant frat dudes as much as the next guy, scare the contents of their battles out of them with a couple of well-placed spells to the man berries. Look at these dudes. Bro. Dude. Bro. Bro. Each ghost you're given and a crew through the game has a backstory or epitaph. Why and how they died will offer you clues as to their spooked out speciality. I just want to finish the tune I was playing. Spirit is fettered or attached to a specific place. Gremlins mess with machines. Sprites mess with wind and ghostly music. Horses or sandmen give you nightmares. Clatterclaws here is not your normal spider once you pry it open his fangs and take a gander at his venom within. Swarm and spawn spells make him a good choice for total room coverage. Weather, wind, and personal space are these shades ace of spades, and the slimy little sims don't stand a chance. Each locale is ripe with objectives. Mansions hide secrets in their darkened rooms, and so too do the nasty little residents bundle away horrible deeds in the cellars of their minds. Your objective will sometimes not be to scare your victims away, but towards objectives and discoveries. In the Calamityville Horror, the cops need to find the bodies the nasty granny killed in order for you to level up. This house looks familiar. Yes, it's the ranch-style remnants of the home of the flesh-bound Necronomicon from Evil Dead. The kids are looking for the evil book, and you have to guide them to it. Once they perform their ritual, their souls will be torn from their bodies, and you, Victorious, will level up. This game's got everything going for it. Humor, pop culture references, a quick response graphics engine, and... Bro. Dude. Bro. Bro. Not you, dorks. Where was I? Oh, yes. And a gruesome amount of character development pertaining to the rotting, expired leftovers of life. We love Hassling Sims, and we love this game. We give it a five out of five. Yeah.